Multi Choice uh, Nigeria is the company, uh, I mean the holding company, we are the subscriber management company. Uh, DSTV is our platform which we use to deliver entertainment. Mnet is one of our sister companies which is focused on producing content. So the Mnet channels, the African Magic channels are you know, produced by Mnet. While Supersports is our sports focused subsidiary which is focused on sports content from around the world. Uh, when I say sports content from around the world, I mean, I, I know easily what comes to people's minds is the English Premier League or uh, the Champions League. But I think for us here, uh, most important is the Nigerian Premier League, which Supersports has successfully produced and put on air week in, week out. Uh, and I, I mean, we can all see the uh, quality of football in the last few years is getting better. And if you look at Nigerian basketball, that's, a, that's been another big success for us because as we as multi-choice sponsor the, uh, we, the DSTV Basketball League and we've got Super Sports showing those games live on air. So uh, from, from a structure... Structural perspective, uh, multi choice Nigeria is you know the subscriber management and the company in Nigeria, while uh, the uh, sister companies produce more of the content. Well, I think what <coughs> we've, I think one of the good things is we've been able to achieve uh, quite a few important milestones. Uh, there's a lot of buzz about digital television uh, and the migration. Uh, but our DSTV platform was uh, actually the second uh, platform in the world to migrate from uh, analog to terrestrial on satellite. So we've been bringing quality digital entertainment into Nigeria uh, since 1996. Uh, we, we did that even before some of the so-called developed nations mm. uh, could do that. Uh, but not not only that. Uh, I mean, from uh, we we. Very early on, we were able to launch an uplink facility in Nigeria, which was fully built by the company, uh, where we uplinked uh, our local channels. Uh, NTA International has been on DSTV uh, channels, uh, Silverbed Television, the radio stations. This was done more, more like a corporate social responsibility project by MultiChoice because these channels were uplinked at no cost to the channel owners, and that continues till today. So for us, it's been uh, uh, it's been gains, and it's been an opportunity for multi-choice Nigeria to put Nigerian content out there. I mean, Africa Magic is uh, one of the biggest brands in Africa now, and uh, as we say, it's taken uh, Nigeria to the rest of the continent. Uh, anywhere you go in Africa now, uh, the the you are almost addressed with a few words from a Nigerian language. Mm -hmm. That is how the Nigerian culture has been exported. And we tell people that you don't see, uh, maybe at times, maybe you don't feel the impact until you're flying into Kenya and someone calls you Igwe. Mm -hmm. And uh, you wonder, uh, how did he get that word? 10 years ago, would he have had an idea of the fact that he could call you Igwe?